In this tutorial we're going to cover connecting a GE Series 90 Micro with our GE USB SNP cable. And first we're going to start by plugging in the cable and setting up the COM port. And this is a Windows 7 32-bit machine. And while the while it's loading, we're going to go ahead and open up our software. Actually, first let's open up our control panel. Hardware and sound, device manager. Let's see where that port is set. All right, so this particular cable is set up as COM3. Minimize that. And we're going to need the GE Prophecy Machine Edition. And we're first, um, let's just do a new project. And this is going to be a 90 micro. And this will be our upload, upload test. So first, let's rename our target. We'll name that from change it from target one to micro. 90 and let's go online with it there's not a red X it's just kind of opposite of what I would have thought but if there's not a red X then that means you're not communicating to it or you're not online so you can go online here but first let's set up the properties the default is COM1 we know our cable is COM3 and that's really the only thing that we have to set up and everything else is we'll leave as default um, and then we can go online as it's connecting you'll see this light go through there and you can also see down here in the feedback zone um, that it was connecting and now it's connected to the device on our cable, on the side of the cable, you see a TX and a RX. This is our USB cable, and that's a transmit and receive. Let's uh, let's upload the program that's in it, and we'll leave all that. Because I want to go ahead and upload everything. That way it's all up to date. You wish to overwrite the current? Yes. And this is if you're walking up to a machine and you're going to troubleshoot a machine and you didn't have anything that you wanted to do to it other than troubleshoot it and you wanted to get the logic out of it and you did not have it. Main is where the logic's going to be stored at. Um, so we can double click that and then this is the actual logic that's inside of it and that's inside of it that's running. It's not a big program in this one. This is just our test that we put in our trainers um, so we can test the lights and everything before we send them out.